What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Jeff back again. I'm just getting to the airport, headed to Chicago. Um, the goal for this trip is to stay active, enjoy myself. So I made it to Chicago safe and sound. Now I'm about to jump on the train to head downtown. Doors closing. All of our bins, all of our watch doors, doors closing. I think we gonna make it. Hitting a lot of bumps. Got my boy Mike right here in the cut. What up, what up? Yes sir, we out here. We about to chill out for the night, get some good food, some good drink. So we just got checked into the hotel. We are staying at the Royal Sinesta. Um, we caught it for a good deal. It was a four-star hotel. I think we got it for $600. It was buy two, get one free. Um, we got that deal just because we planned in advance. It's downtown in the heart of the city. I would recommend if you stay in downtown to plan in advance so you can get a good rate. Check out different websites, compare them so you can get a good deal. Good morning, YouTube. It's day one here in Chicago, so I just woke up. The first thing I'm gonna do is a 10 minute meditation session. Then I'm gonna head downstairs and get a good workout. Here at the Riverwalk, I'm um, doing some exploring. I'm headed to the Cloud Gate to check out one of the iconic spots here in Chicago. That's the Emerald First Lady Cruise. This is the McCormick famous ice skating ring in Millennium Park. Um, this is the ice skating ring you hear people talking about all the time on TikTok. It is open for free to the public. It's open from November to March. Um, I would recommend you to check it out if you're into like ice skating. Definitely check it out. I think it's, it looks really cool. Um, it's a lot of space. Um, this is part of Millennium Park, so there's a lot of other stuff to do here. If you look to the left, that's the uh, beam. That's where we're going to be headed to today. So the Cloud Gate is definitely one of my favorite pieces of art here in Chicago. Um, I definitely recommend you... If to come early if you're going to visit the cloud gate or the beam whatever you call it locals call it the beam um because it does get crowded around 10 11 a.m um i actually came back the next day to do some more exploring just because there was so many people so just take that into consideration plan in advance and uh, get there early so you can get some good photos and uh, enjoy your time also be sure to check out the crown fountain it's right below the beam it was created by Gemma palinsa um, I think it's really cool. Um, be careful because it does spit out water um, in the summertime. So it's really cool. Definitely check it out. I think it's a really dope piece of art. Um, definitely photo worthy. So check. At the Millennium Park, I ran into Urban Space to get some food. Um, it's a food hall and it has a bunch of Chicago's food. Definitely check it out. I just got some Mediterranean trying to keep it slightly healthy. So I'm here at the Willis Tower about to check out the Sky Deck. I've been waiting so long to get up here and check the Sky Deck out. I'm super excited. So the sky deck is definitely cool. I would recommend checking the local forecast. It was very cloudy, so I couldn't really see that much. So you just wanna check the weather and make sure it's gonna be good for you to go to the sky deck. Um, what I'm doing now is having a beer and waiting on my cab to get here. And then we're gonna to head to the museum just to check that out. So I decided to check out the Museum of Contemporary Arts. I think it has a lot to offer. Um, it had this very cool staircase. Um, it had five floors of different cool art pieces. Um, I definitely think it's worth going to check out, especially if you've never been to like a contemporary art museum. Um, it has a lot of history, probably has a lot of stuff you didn't know about. So definitely consider it. Let me know in the comments if you like museums or not. So if you're a coffee lover, you have to check this Starbucks out. This Starbucks is the biggest Starbucks in the world. It's a Starbucks reserve. It's right on the Magnificent Mile. Um, they have free coffee taste and it's five stories. You got to check this place out. The food is amazing. It was one of my favorite Starbucks I've ever been to. How you doing, bro? Mm -hmm. 
Chicago has been really dope this far. There's a lot to do out here, a lot of things to see. There's a lot of history in Chicago. If you've never been to Chicago, you definitely want to add that to your bucket list. So in my opinion, if you're going to Chicago, you don't need a car. To get the best experience, I recommend riding the uh, public transportation. You got the metro system, you got bikes. Um, the city is very walkable. So another one of my favorite things here in Chicago is the river walk. I'm out here at the river walk, about to do some walking. So I'm a huge water person. I just love being around the water. It just gives me so much peace. So that's so what I did this morning. I came out here and just walked that rural walk. It's really peaceful, good views. So after all this walking, I worked up an appetite. I hit the G Gunnels to get some of the deep dish Chicago pizza. It's probably one of the best pizzas I've ever tried in my life. So if you're in Chicago, definitely check out G Gunnels. So today is my last day in Chicago. I headed down to the Navy Pier to get some uh, good views and some good food and drinks. Um, definitely recommend the Ferris wheel. Uh, the views is probably the best views in the city. Why, what happened? I, love blue, I, I thought you was joking. I thought it was too strong or something. Hell no. Here at the Navy Pier in Chicago, this is a dope view. Like the scenery is amazing. If you ever in Chicago, I highly recommend you to check out this pier. Check it out. This pier is dope. I'm here with my brother Mike. Hey, yes, sir. You gotta come check this out. I don't even do Ferris wheels, but this one like that. Yeah, we out here vibing. I'm scared to get the view from this end because I don't want to tip this thing over. But uh, as you can see, the view is phenomenal. We can swap seats for real. Yeah, so definitely check out this view. Oh shit, mate. Well, you gonna move or you need to get in the middle? <laughs> All right. I don't think it's gonna go anywhere. I don't think so either. It's just a, it's a me thing. <clears throat> So to finish my Chicago trip, I jumped on the water taxi just to catch some last good views before I head to the airport. This is going to complete the video. I want to thank you for being a part of this video. I'm definitely going to be creating a lot more travel content. Stay tuned. Thank you for being a part of my channel. I hope you enjoy it. Until next time. Peace.